What would 12 years old you think of how you are now? You turned out exactly how I expected, but somehow, I'm still disappointed. He would honestly think I'm like the coolest guy ever and be pumped about the future, but that's just because he had really 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 bad taste. Why are you still a virgin? Even I lost my virginity. Jealous of the allowance my boss gives me. Little does he know, it's actually pitiful. You're going to drink that much? At 11 am? Wow, your life is boring. Disappointed at best. I was an idiot at 12 so he'd think I was cool. Now me is an idiot too but I only think I'm kinda cool. He would be disappointed because I'm not a professional football player or a rap artist. That little delusional brat. She wouldn't waste her time thinking about old people. Anyone over 30 was not interesting. She'll get depression earlier. Sure, I become successful but my hairline is going to recede and start becoming bald starts violently sobbing. Disappointed because my life is nothing like she wanted. 16 year old me would be proud of me dealing with my issues though and I think that matters more. 12 year old me had no friends, was bullied, and hated everything in his life. He had fears of getting fat, dying alone, and spending his days hidden from the world. He would cry at how well we've wound up, married, working as an engineer, with a home, a baby on the way, shitloads of close friends whom I love and would do anything for, and the kids who used to bully me wound up exactly where they belonged. Hey, you have Star Wars. It's right here on the shelf. Hey, why is it on the shelf? Why aren't you watching Star Wars? You have Star Wars. Can we watch Star Wars now? I'm more fit now so he'd probably be like Dambro, nice biceps. She'd be appalled at who I married, my husband and I went to grade school together we did not get along at all. Probably disappointed I didn't go to her school of choice or finish college. I'm not a famous artist, I don't work for Marvel Comics, and I don't have any kids. Probably nothing. That would require me taking my mind off of my hot math teacher Miss Harper, and that rarely happened with 12 year old me. I'd be very impressed. I was overweight, depressed, basically friendless, and had, didn't know at the time, but being an adult now, it is very clear, some kind of attention disorder. Had horrible grades because I just didn't care parents didn't so why should I? Wasn't into sports at the time either. I'm now in a successful position in a very successful company, with a great social life and an awesome little family. I just bought a house I'd never in my wildest dreams thought I'd be able to afford. I'm still about 20 pounds overweight, but my husband likes my curvy butt and chest so I call that a win I suppose. Don't get me wrong, there have been plenty of ups and downs, but overall, I'm doing alright for myself which is something I'd never thought would be the case at 12. Probably upset that I'm not a vet and don't own a Scarlett McCoy it's okay, little me. I found a much better aspiration and I have a cool ferret instead. Whoa, so I'm gay? The me of today is what the 12 year old version fantasized about becoming, a performing musician and instructor slash professor. Can only speculate. But I think the 12 year old me would be surprised and pleased that it actually happened after years of study and hard work. He'd be stoked that I still play D and Amp, D and probably faint in joy at the sight of my RPG bookshelf. She'd be proud. She stood up to her abusive mother, and got the help she's always needed. Edit, holy shit, my first silver. Thank you kind stranger. Edit 2, holy shit my first gold. Thank you kind stranger. Terribly disappointed and saddened. Even if things aren't bad necessarily, it will be disappointing for a good number of people BC of the killing of most childhood dreams. 12 me, you're fat. Me, you're... Fuck, I'm gay? Oh all the softball makes sense now. My wife's boobs are huge, he'd be happy. Shocked that I was actually diagnosed with a mental illness. Sad because mom has passed. Happy that I have my own PC. Freaked because I hated long hair. Which is what I have now. I hope she'd be proud, I've gone a lot I never thought I ever could. He'd ask why I am still alive. 12 Yomi would call 19 Yomi a pedophile. Too bad his dad's going to die in a month, and puberty is going to hit him like a freight train in a week. 
Honestly, he'd think I'm awesome. I came out much more attractive than I ever thought, for starters. I get to make pictures for a living and the minor success I've had with my band and writing music all while being in a long-term relationship. Only downside is still living with my parents, a shitload of student loan debt, sometimes crippling anxiety, and a minor drinking problem. Well considering that I turned 13 four days ago he wouldn't think a whole lot. She'd think I'm hot. Wait, how are you a girl? 50-50, I suppose. Surprised I'm alive and sane, but sad I'm not a rich badass. He would think that getting divorced meant that I had failed as a person, and he would be very wrong. Damn you smoke a lot of weed. He would think I was a loser because I put down the skateboard and started actually trying to be a part of society. Shit he would call me a fucking loser. Ashamed. My 12 year old self would be proud. A little confused slash surprised with where I ended up. It's different from what my 12 year old self saw. But I have a heck in good life so I think they'd be proud of all the work I've done and who I've become. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more.